This is Jay Estes. I'm a deputy for flight test integration in the Orion program. What you see here is a Delta IV heavy booster being launched from the pad. This is a flight test that Orion's going to conduct in 2014. It's a Delta IV heavy unmanned booster with two strap-on boosters on the side. Once we get through first stage, the strap-on boosters separate themselves and the central core continues on as a second stage. Once we get to low Earth orbit, the second stage shuts down and separates itself from the spacecraft and the upper stage. At that point, the upper stage lights and takes us onto orbit, and the service module panels separate, and then the launch abort system with its shroud, and which has been covering the, the capsule, comes off. In low Earth orbit, which is about 250 miles above the surface of the Earth, we make one orbit, and this orbit lets us check out our systems. After one orbit, we ignite the upper stage and we lift the orbit to about 3,600 miles. Now, 3,600 miles is approximately 10 times higher than any man-rated spaceship has been since 1972 when we came back from the moon. And the reason we're doing this is to test our heat shield on entry. The heat shield will be exposed to uh, heating much like you would get from the moon, and uh, we'll be able to demonstrate that our heat shield is sufficient for recovering people from missions beyond Earth. And as we begin to enter, the capsule then separates from the service module section. The service module section stays attached to the upper stage, and here you see control jets that are firing to control the attitude for entry. And as we enter, we experience the maximum heating lower in the atmosphere. And this is a primary test of Exploration Flight Test 1, is that heat shield. As we get low in the atmosphere, the forward bay cover comes off, which covers the parachutes. And two small chutes come out to slow us down. And after we slow down, those separate. Three small pilot chutes come out to open three main parachutes, which initially open at about 3% opening. Then they go to 10% open, and then they go to full open. We use those staging to keep the forces on the chutes lower. It makes for a softer ride, and it keeps our chutes safe. We enter the water at a slight angle to help the crew with the impact to the water. The parachutes fall in the water. We hope to recover those. And we're cooperating with the Navy, and we're using one of their well deck ships uh, to recover our capsule. And this Orion, after this space flight, will be refurbished and used again on an ascent abort test in the future.